A Giant's Grip Introducing High Gravity Written by Neil deGrasse Tyson Imagine a planet much like our own. It orbits a distant star bathed in its warmth. This planet has oceans, continents and an atmosphere. But there's a crucial difference. This planet is much larger than Earth. Its gravity is significantly stronger. This difference in gravity changes everything. It shapes the planet's terrain, its atmosphere, and even the life that might exist there. Let's embark on a cosmic journey to understand this fascinating concept. Let's explore a world where gravity reigns supreme. Sculpted by gravity, terrain and oceans. On a high gravity planet, the landscape would be dramatically different from Earth's. Mountains, formed by the collision of tectonic plates, would be shorter and squatter. The immense gravitational force would pull them downwards, preventing them from reaching the towering heights we see on our planet. Imagine a world where the peaks of mountains are not as sharp and jagged, but rather more rounded and subdued. This is because the gravitational force exerts a constant downward pressure, reshaping the very crust of the planet. The immense gravitational force would pull them downwards, preventing them from reaching the towering heights we see on our planet. This gravitational influence would also affect the erosion processes, making them more pronounced. Over time, the mountains would wear down more quickly, leading to a landscape that is more uniform and less varied in elevation. The valleys between these mountains would also be shallower, as the force of gravity would compress the land, reducing the depth of any depressions. Oceans too would feel the pull. They would be shallower, their depths compressed by the weight of the water above. The immense pressure from the gravitational force would push the water molecules closer together, making the oceans denser. This would result in a unique marine environment where the pressure at the ocean floor would be much higher than what we experience on Earth. Marine life would have to adapt to these conditions, potentially leading to entirely different ecosystems. The coastlines might look similar to Earth's, but the ocean floors would be significantly closer to the surface. The shallow waters would create extensive tidal zones where the interplay between land and sea is more pronounced. These tidal zones would be rich in nutrients, supporting a diverse array of life forms. The shallower oceans would also mean that sunlight could penetrate deeper, allowing photosynthetic organisms to thrive at greater depths than on Earth. The very shape of the planet might even be more uniform, closer to a perfect sphere, due to the intense gravitational pull. This uniformity would extend to the planet's surface, with fewer variations in elevation and a more consistent landscape. The gravitational force would also influence the planet's atmosphere, potentially leading to more stable weather patterns. The intense gravity would create a thicker atmosphere, which could trap more heat and lead to a warmer climate overall. This would have profound effects on the planet's ecosystems and the types of life that could thrive there. A heavy blanket. Atmosphere and climate. The atmosphere of a high gravity planet would be incredibly dense. Gases would be held more tightly by the planet's gravitational pull, creating a thick, heavy blanket around the world. This dense atmosphere would have a profound effect on the climate. It would scatter sunlight, creating a dim, reddish hue on the surface. Winds would be slower and more powerful, carrying immense weight as they moved across the land. Volcanic eruptions, though less frequent, would be far more violent spewing ash and gas high into the thick atmosphere. The weight of the world. 
Life under high gravity. Life on a high gravity planet would face significant challenges. The intense gravity would make movement difficult. Creatures would need to be incredibly strong and sturdy, with dense bones and powerful muscles, just to support their own weight. Plants would need robust structures to grow upright, and flying creatures, if they existed at all, would need to be incredibly powerful flyers. The very act of living would be a constant battle against the relentless pull of gravity. A lighter touch, exploring low gravity. Now, let's imagine the opposite scenario: a planet with significantly lower gravity than Earth. Here, the landscape would be vastly different. Mountains might soar to unimaginable heights. Their peaks piercing the thin atmosphere, oceans would be deeper, their vastness stretching far below the surface. The reduced gravitational pull would allow for larger, more delicate life forms. Creatures might be tall and slender, able to leap great distances with ease. Reaching for the stars, space travel, and gravity. Space travel from a low-gravity planet would be significantly easier than from Earth. Rockets would require far less fuel to escape the planet's gravitational pull, making space exploration more feasible. This lower gravitational barrier could potentially accelerate the development of spacefaring civilizations. However, on our high-gravity world, launching even a small spacecraft would require immense amounts of fuel and powerful engines. The challenges of overcoming the planet's gravitational grip would be enormous. A balancing act: the challenges of each world. Both high gravity and low gravity environments present unique challenges. On a high gravity planet, the sheer weight of everything would be a constant obstacle. Buildings would need to be incredibly strong. And even simple tasks like walking or lifting objects would require significant effort. On a low gravity planet, the challenges would be different. The lack of gravity could lead to muscle and bone loss in living organisms. Structures would need to be designed to withstand the stresses of a thinner atmosphere, and potentially more extreme temperature variations. Earth. Our precious oasis, our own planet Earth, exists in a delicate balance. Its gravity is strong enough to hold our atmosphere and oceans in place, yet not so strong that it hinders our movement or prevents the existence of life as we know it. The diversity of life on our planet is a testament to this perfect balance. From the smallest insects. To the largest whales, life on Earth has adapted to thrive under the specific conditions our planet provides. The allure of the unknown. The vastness of space holds endless possibilities. It stretches out in every direction, an infinite expanse that has captivated human imagination for centuries. From the twinkling stars that dot the night sky. To the mysterious black holes that lurk in the depths of the cosmos, space is a realm of endless wonder and discovery. It is teeming with planets of all shapes, sizes, and gravitational forces. Each planet is a world unto itself, with unique characteristics and environments. Some are gas giants with swirling storms, while others. Are rocky and barren. The diversity of these celestial bodies is a testament to the boundless creativity of the universe. Imagining the challenges and wonders of life on these worlds sparks our curiosity and fuels our desire to explore the universe. The thought of humans one day setting foot on distant planets, building colonies, and thriving in environments. Vastly different from our own, is both thrilling and daunting.
It pushes the boundaries of what we believe is possible and inspires us to reach for the stars. The search for life beyond Earth often focuses on planets within the habitable zone, where conditions might be suitable for liquid water and, potentially, life. These planets, often referred to as Goldilocks planets, are neither too hot nor too cold, but just right for sustaining life as we know it. The discovery of such planets brings us one step closer to answering the age-old question, are we alone in the universe? But who knows what strange and wonderful forms of life might exist on planets outside this narrow zone? adapted to conditions we can only begin to imagine. Life, in its infinite adaptability, might thrive in environments that are completely inhospitable to us. From the icy moons of Jupiter to the scorching surface of Venus, the potential for life in the universe is as vast and varied as the cosmos itself. The allure of the unknown drives us to keep exploring to keep searching and to keep dreaming of what lies beyond our current understanding. A universe of possibilities. As we continue to explore the cosmos, we must remember the importance of cherishing our own planet. The vast expanse of space holds countless mysteries and wonders, yet it also serves as a reminder of the fragility and uniqueness of our home. Each mission to the stars, each discovery of a new celestial body, brings with it a deeper understanding of the universe and our place within it. Earth, with its perfect balance of gravity, atmosphere and life-sustaining conditions, is a rare and precious oasis in the vastness of space. Our planet's delicate ecosystems and diverse life forms are a testament to the intricate and delicate balance that sustains life. From the highest mountains to the deepest oceans, every corner of our world is teeming with life, each species playing a vital role in the web of existence. The study of other planets, whether they are dominated by crushing gravity, or offer a weightless existence, allows us to appreciate the uniqueness of our own world. By examining the harsh and varied conditions of other celestial bodies, we gain insight into the extraordinary conditions that make Earth habitable. These explorations not only expand our scientific knowledge, but also deepen our appreciation for the delicate balance that sustains life on our planet. It reminds us that life, in all its forms, is a precious and awe-inspiring phenomenon. The resilience and adaptability of life, from the smallest microorganisms to the largest mammals, highlight the incredible diversity and tenacity of living organisms. Each life form, no matter how small or seemingly insignificant, contributes to the rich tapestry of life on Earth. Let us continue to explore, to learn, and to protect our pale blue dot, the only home we know. As we venture further into the cosmos, let us carry with us the knowledge and wisdom gained from our explorations, using it to safeguard and cherish our planet. For in the grand tapestry of the universe, Earth is our sanctuary, our cradle of life and it is our responsibility to ensure its preservation for future generations.